Greetings, Cauldron of Weird. Welcome back. We are here in Cincinnati, once again at Bogarts, in the front room stage this time for September morning. I know it's only been a week since I was in Cincinnati, but I'm back again. I'm ready to rock the fuck out. This is going to be a hell of a show because it's been a couple years since I've seen September morning, but they always fucking kill it. No. <laughs>
so I just got back to Columbus and um, yeah, well, I forgot to do the recap at the venue, so we'll just do it now in the car before I um, go inside. So a uh, couple detractors from tonight. One, I hated the way the venue was set up tonight. They were doing the front room session uh, stage, the small stage, and when they just close off the big room. Really annoying, really not a fan of that because the stage isn't raised up at all and if you're behind someone taller than you, then you're kind of fucked. And that that is really, really obnoxious for someone that, as I am, I'm short. You know, that, that ain't cool. Um, but also the first band, uh, Charcoal Tongue, I think is what they were called. Wasn't too keen on them. They really didn't fit the show. They really weren't, um, really weren't, they, they felt kind of, uh, and I'm not trying to, bad mouth them but they, they felt like kind of an off-brand siler so not really uh i wasn't really digging them but kaleido was sick they were super good loved the energy from them loved the performance loved the stage presence from them the plus the music kicked ass um so uh charcoal tongue i'll give a six out of ten so yeah pretty serious detract from there um the the venue doesn't help either the Kaleida will get a 9 out of 10, and I I'm, I'm can't wait to check out more of them. They said they have a music video coming out, so uh, be sure to check out that reaction coming soon. <laughs> um, yeah, also, September morning, though, the band I was there to see, killed. Totally killed. They were amazing. They're always amazing. Every time I've seen them, they've been great. And, uh, yeah, they... they fucking rocked it i also give them a nine out of ten all in all um given the performance from all three bands plus the problems with the venue i give the show an eight out of ten um kaleido and september morning really saved the show but like that venue set up for bogart's not good not good very very unpleasant i'm kind of glad this was the first and only time i've uh had to deal with that stage setup because that was awful. Um, I'll be back there in October with uh, a couple of my friends for Trivium. But uh, next show that I know of is Absolute Hero, and I think Heroes like villains. It's a couple of lo couple of local bands, so uh, we'll see how that all goes. But for now, this is Corey from Culture of Weird signing off. Uh, it was another successful show, concert number 254, so I'm getting a little high up there in these numbers. Um, if you want to go to concerts like this, you can use our SeatGeek code, um, SG Cauldron. Um, if you like what we do and want to support what we do, Patreon at patreon.com forward slash G of weird. Check out all of our tiers, but I'll see you next time. I'll be the same. Bye.